today i would like to teach you the missed side of the perimeter which is found in geometrical figures the missed side i have a model problem here which talks about length of two sides of a given triangle which is a measuring 5 cm and 6 cm and uh, one unknown side if that has to be learned you see in order to find the length of remaining side subtract the sum of all the given sides from its perimeter that's the loop what we have we have to understand this so uh, for that what am i uh, going to do is i am going to take a snapshot of this uh, model problem and from here we are going to learn the newer problem let me paste here and in this case little bit further and i'm going to place here this model sum what is the sum all about the length of two sides of the given figure that is triangle pqr pq represents 6 cm qr represents nothing and rp represents 5 cm in the main session we would have learned the perimeter of the triangle pqr is nothing but the sum of all the sides that means perimeter of the triangle pqr is equal to pq plus qr plus rp that's what we have studied in the previous chapter now we have the unknown sides rq our intention is to find rq so here the sum says perimeter of the given uh, three sides is equal to 15 cm and we are supposed to subtract sum of those two sides which we knew that is 5 plus 6 which is 11 cm and therefore the length of the third side is going to be 15 minus 11 which is just 4 cm but how did we arrived at this decision perimeter of the sides are 15 cm and sum of the known sides are 5 cm plus 6 cm which is given over here which is 11 cm and here we have a formula length and the third side is equal to perimeter minus sum of two sides that is the length of the third side is equal to 15 cm minus 11 cm which is equal to 4 cm so we are going to work on this particular part what it is i am going to take this uh pen okay and i am going to work on this part of the formula length on third side is equal to the perimeter of the given sides minus sum of two known sides so i am going to teach you how to do this for the next sum where i have an exercise here so let me choose this sum from here okay i have chosen this let me take it to my uh, table here and in the table i have uh, this let me cut that okay take this little bit uh, smaller than the usual okay i have here and uh, what am i supposed to do now i am supposed to type what is given the known sides are uh, let me type the perimeter of the given figure uh, kindly uh, hold this on hold this okay i have perimeter of the rectangle in this case which has uh, four sides is equal to 24 cm which is given okay then known sides are in this uh, rectangle 
which is uh, P PQ plus one second PQ plus SR plus RP which is uh, equal to 10 plus 10 20 20 plus 2 22 centimeter and now what am I going to do I take this one what is this length of one second length of unknown side here in this case it is Q S is equal to how much? This is what is my question. But what we have learned in the previous is length of Q S is equal to perimeter of P Q R S minus sum of, what is this, known size. So, my sum is going to be QS is equal to what it is? 24 centimeter minus 22 centimeter which is nothing but QS is equal to how much it is 24 minus 22 which is just 2 centimeter so when I complete this sign I arrive at QS the unknown side is equal to 2 centimeter okay this is one such uh, sum let me try for uh, one more sum over here. In this figure the length of one side is 7 cm. If all the sides are equal then find its uh, perimeter. Let me do this one as an example. Yeah. So I will take this. I am going to place this here. And uh, before that let me adjust the side. Okay. I have this. Hope everybody can see this. Now, when I have equal sides what is that? When I have equal sides, it means it's a square. It's a square. Now, perimeter of a square. Square is equal to four sides multiplied with 7 centimeter. So, if that is the case, what is the perimeter? I have this. Let me put it like this. Perimeter of a square is equal to 4 7 sub. How much it is? 28 centimeter. So this is going to be your sum. The known side is given. Unknown sides, we try to find it. If all the sides are equal, then find its perimeter. That is what the question they have asked here. So our intention was to teach you length of the third side is equal to perimeter minus sum of two sides if the given geometrical figure has three sides. Suppose if it has four sides and one is unknown, what are we supposed to do? Length of the fourth side is equal to perimeter of those geometrical figures minus sum of the known three sides. In case if it is five, try to tell me the perimeter of the whole five sides minus sum of 
the known four sides. That's right. Thank you very much.